Good one. Raymond Johnstone here reporting once again. I hope life finds you all well and living honestly. Um, I wanted to touch base on uh, the last article post that I put up and decomplexify it a little bit. When I talk about transparency and living transparently, really what I'm talking about is just living honestly. Um, so, you know, I, I know that I put set some explanation obviously in the post there as well, but to decomplexify something even further, this is my statement of my desire to live more honestly to the world. Um, another one of the... I, I want to actually go back again to another one of the posts that I put up a little while back called Vision and Revision. And I realized while just briefly looking at it today that um, Vision and Revision is actually um, a very s simple way of living that... Uh, you know, I think I think entrepreneurs specifically have really nailed down to a science in that, you know, you get you get involved in a project and you start. And then as you're involved in the project, you learn more and you learn more and you find out what you need to learn about and you learn more, but while you're in the project, you're learning and you're learning. So rather than you know, there's so many people that talk about, like, even me, I I just launched Powerfield Consulting, but I've been thinking about that for a year now. So, really, it's just a question of, rather than sitting there and thinking about something, is to get up and go and get it started. You'll find the information that you need. Whatever it is that you're doing, you will. If you really have that much will around it and you really want to do it that badly and it is that much of a dream for you, you will make it happen. I can speak from personal truth in terms of that. Uh, the last thing that I wanted to touch base on real quick is, um, just because we have a little bit of a time limit here as well, is just, I, th I was thinking about how many different aspects of my life involve group effort. Um, all the different hats that I wear. Uh, really, my life itself is one big group effort. I'm just... I don't know about the rest of you, if you, you know, even if you just, like, have one partner that you work with pretty regularly that, you know, you kind of they lean on you, you lean on them, they get you some knowledge, you get them some knowledge, and it's just like a consistent trade back and forth of value that actually generates more value on top of it. So it was really interesting for me to put that into perspective in my day-to-day -day life, and obviously, you know, if you've heard me explain my definition of collaboration before, then you realize that, you know, if you're working in a group towards a particular effort, then you're, you know, engaged in collaborative, uh, in, in the collaborative commons, essentially. So that's something that I wanted to touch base on again, uh, as well as, and, you know, that simplification as well, is just to maybe take a look at your life and, you know, where do you collaborate? Where do you work in group efforts to create value? That's all for Raymond. Hope you all have a lovely day.